Cubic is one of, or in my opinion, the most exciting projects in the crypto space right now. It has some seriously revolutionary things going on with it. It isn't a blockchain or a DAG, it is instead the world's first quorum platform. It is a layer zero project, meaning all crypto projects can be built on top of it. It can process over 40 million transactions per second and the transactions are fee-less. But one of the most amazing things about Cubic is its feature called Agart. This is an area of Cubic that is hard to gather information on and it seems to, to be quite misunderstood. So in this video, I'm going to tell you what Agart is and why it could change the whole world forever. Modern artificial intelligence has primarily been built by the top tech companies in the world like Meta, Google, Amazon, Microsoft and Apple. Although the progress these companies have made with artificial intelligence has been fantastic and is changing the, the world, it also presents a moral and philosophical problem. What happens when one of these companies creates the first artificial general intelligence or AGI? An AGI would be the first AI that is smarter than any human and can be interacted with in a way that shows they are completely autonomous in their identity. Within a few years, this AI would be able to use its intelligence to create improved iterations of itself, and it is expected that it will very quickly surpass the intelligence of the whole human race combined. If a company like Google were the first to invent this AGI, it could have disastrous implications for the rest of humanity. Google would soar to being the top tech company in the world and they they would start developing new technology at a pace that no other company could keep up with. They would end up being the most dominant company in the world by far. And then, when you think about it, since Google is an American company, the USA would end up becoming the most powerful country on earth by far, which would obviously be a huge issue for any other country that doesn't want to align with US policies. I mean, this sort of de development really could lead to a future that includes something like Skynet from the Terminator movies, which, you know, seems so far-fetched only a couple of days ago, de decades ago, I mean, when I was a kid. But thankfully, these gigantic companies and even nations aren't actually able to build an AGI right now because they don't have the computational resources to do it. There is a worldwide computational resources war happening right now where every industry is battling for computational power to drive their projects and there isn't anywhere near enough chips and enough computational power to serve the whole market and the demand for computational power is only growing and growing. Compute resources are becoming the oil of the future and this is where Q Cubic and Agart step in. So Cubic was created by Sergey Ivan Cheglo, whose name I can never pronounce correctly, so apologies, who is also the creator of NXT and IOTA. Ivan Cheglo has long been aware of the artificial intelligence issues facing the world of the future and has for a long time planned on building something that can fix these issues. Cubic at the basic level is a layer zero quorum and it's the first of its kind. It is a system that is designed to connect all other blockchains and DAGs together. Decentralized apps can be built on the platform, smart contracts can be run on it, and Cubic is capable of scaling to handle the transactional power of the whole world. But the real magic of Cubic comes in the form of its useful proof of work model. Basically, miners can use their computer to mine Cubic and earn passive income. This is the same process that is used by Bitcoin to great success. But the unique thing about Cubic is that it puts the miners' co computational resources to use. These computational resources are used to power Agart. And Agart is building artificial neural network all over the world. So take a second to get your head around this, because it took me quite a while and I'm still coming to grips with this. But basically, Cubic is creating a supercomputer the likes of which the world has never seen and is doing this through miners. And this supercomputer is completely decentralized because it has been powered by individuals all over the world. So let's take, for example, Steve. Steve wants to earn some passive income. He has a powerful gaming computer that he only plays games on for two hours per day. The rest of the day, his games 
computer sits around doing nothing. So it's completely idle. For 22 hours, his super powerful computer is just wasted. Steve realizes that he can earn a lot of money if he starts using his gaming computer to mine Cubic during his downtime. Now Steve is earning a consistent passive income every day and he is happy. But what Steve might not be aware of is that his computer has just become a single neural network in the Cubic's supercomputer. Now Steve's computer is based in the USA but other people just like Steve all around the world are doing the exact same thing to earn an income. Steve's computer is now linking together with computers in the UK, in Europe, in China, Ireland, Africa, Australia, Russia, Japan and anywhere else that you can think of. All these computers are linking together to build an artificial neural network and the most powerful supercomputer the world has ever seen. This supercomputer is already more powerful than any computing system run by Amazon, Google, Meta, Microsoft or Apple. This super powerful computer isn't controlled by any one person and it is constantly training, becoming more like an AGI every day. This is what Agart is bringing to fruition. The first AI super brain that will, will evolve just like the human brain and bring us into the next era of humanity and into the era of artificial general intelligence and a future where human brains as they are now are obsolete. I mean that is one hell of an exciting project and if that doesn't make you bullish and cubic I don't know what will. Of course this is all still in the very early phases and I won't have complete faith until I see some real evidence that this is happening but you have to admit this is exciting and this is making something possible that the big tech companies can't make possible because they can't get the compute power to create an AGI of their own. How cool is that? And this is why Cubic is something truly revolutionary. Anyway, click on screen now and watch my video on how space is bringing Bitcoin to the masses and why it might be the most undervalued project out there. I'll see you on the outside.